I want to play a game. The same woman has played each of you for a fool, manipulating your love for her and causing nothing but pain. Her fun and games pushed you both to break the law to fulfill her material needs. She is toxic, and today, all of your transgressions will be made public. Now you must choose who will drop out of this triangle. For within 60 seconds, one of you must die. If you wish to save her, then the saws must be pushed all the way to one side or the other, sparing her while proving for good who is indeed the alpha male. What do you think? Are you both strong enough to walk away from what is destroying you? Or will you fight one more time for the heart that binds? You have 60 seconds to decide. Live or die. Make your choice. Hello, Heaven. I want to play a game. The situation you find yourself in is of your own doing. You, your girlfriend, and your friends are all racists. You have intimidated others based on their physical differences. But today, it is you who will run scared. Your pathetic friends follow your every word, Heaven. Therefore, you will be the only one capable of saving them and yourself. In 30 seconds, the jacks holding up this car will fall, setting off a deadly chain of events. In order to stop this from happening, you must tear yourself away from the seat to which you are glued. Then you must pull the red lever before you, but no act comes without a sacrifice. You've judged others by the color of their skin, and today, Evan, you will learn that we are all the same color on the inside. Live or die, Evan. The choice is yours. Hello, Evan. I want to play a game. The situation you find yourself in is of your own doing. You, your girlfriend, and your friends are one racist. You have intimidated others based on their physical differences. Jill Tuck, you're protecting her despite the fact that she had direct knowledge throughout, which makes her complicit in every death. I'll make you a deal. Give her to me. The game stops and no one else dies. If not, everyone dies and you'll be to blame. Make your choice. The clock's ticking. Bobby, before you is one of your trusted colleagues. She has been your publicist for years, knowing your lies, but choosing to speak no evil. She has been richly rewarded for her words, but today she will be rewarded for her silence. In the X-ray, you will see a key, the key to Nina's survival, which will shut off her device. But there's a catch. You have one minute to pull the fish hook from her stomach and unlock her device. 
or else the four spikes will penetrate her throat, silencing Mina forever. Remember, the spikes will also advance each time the decibel level in this room rises above a whisper, killing her even sooner. Will Nina live or die, Bobby? The choice is yours. Hello, Bobby. That feeling running through your body is fear. The fear of not knowing if you have what it takes to survive. Before you is your lawyer, who swore an oath of ethics but chose to see no evil in order to benefit herself. Once her device begins to rotate, it will pierce her eyes and mouth if you don't delay its movement for at least 30 seconds. To do this, you must step into the other machine and lift the bars to the highest position long enough to close the circuit, slowing down her device. If you do nothing, she will whine to her death before the clock runs out. Do you have what it takes to help her? Make your choice. Hello, Gibson. Once again, we're at a moral crossroad. I don't blame you for not giving me Jill Tuck. But you shouldn't let an old grudge cloud your judgment. Look to where you're being led. Look beyond the crossroad to the clear dawn. Do you see it? Hello, Bobby. Across from you is your closest friend. He knows all your sins, yet he acts as though he hears no evil. Today, what he hears will be the difference between life and death. Bobby, you must help Kale walk over the planks and get as close to you as possible. Find your own way across the beams to the key. You must get it to him over the last span between you. If the noose around Kale's neck is not removed within 60 seconds, a winch will be engaged and your secret will be left hanging. Does Kale live or die, Bobby? The choice is yours. Hello, Bobby. Before you is the door that leads to your wife. However, you must first make a choice. As you may have guessed, your decision will be as difficult as pulling teeth. The lock before you requires a four-digit combination to open. However, if it is access you seek, then a true sacrifice will have to be made. Watch and learn, Bobby. The necessary numbers have been etched onto two of your teeth. Look to the chart as a reference for which teeth to pull and in which order to enter the digits. Time is ticking down. You must make your decision quickly. Hello, Bobby. You have almost completed your rebirth. However, your final task will be your most difficult. The woman before you symbolizes your success. She is your trophy, and she has seen the good in your message, despite its dishonest beginnings. Today, we will see if you can truly Bobby. earn her love. To prove your status as a survivor, you must overcome a game that should be all too familiar. You supposedly survived it once already, so it should be easy to survive once again. Pierce the hooks through your chest muscles, and the game will begin. In order to free yourself and your wife, you must hoist yourself with these chains and connect the extension cords above you before the clock expires. Both hands will be needed to complete this task. But that should be simple, for as you claim to understand, the pectoral muscles can easily support your weight. So I ask you, Bobby, when you embrace every day as if it is your last, will it be with your wife? Make your choice. Hello, Dr. Gordon. You are perhaps my greatest asset. Without you, my work over the last few years would not have been possible. That having been said, I have a request. Watch over Jill. And should anything happen to her, 
I want you to act immediately on my behalf. In return for that, I will keep no more secrets from you. I have showed you a lot of places, but there is one that will be perhaps the most meaningful to you.